Hello, hello, good morning. How are you guys doing today? Good morning. Good morning, teacher. Hi, hi, Irma, hello. I'm just trying to get the presentation. Give me one second. Good morning. Hello, good morning. Hey, que se me han hecho. Good morning. Good morning, teacher. Good morning. Good morning, teacher. Hello, Beatrice. Good morning. No, mira que estamos llorando, pues. Why, why? Why, why? Why are you crying? <laughs> ya vamos a ponernos en huelga para que lo dejen a usted aquí con nosotros. <laughs> <laughs> me van, you, me van a echar you. al carajo. <laughs> thank you, thank you. I don't know, I don't know, probably yes, probably no. Oh, now that you mentioned that, Beatrice, me voy a olvidar. Um, you will have to fill out a survey at the end. Voy a tener que llenar una encuesta. Sí lo hicieron con el anterior, ¿verdad? No, 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 no me acuerdo. ¿Verdad que no, Gaby? No, es que nos quedamos sin grupo. Oh, de verdad. Ajá, entonces nos reubicaron. Ah, ah sí. Okay. Gaby y, y Bea iba con el mismo grupo. ¿Dónde iba yo? Ah, y sí. Charlie. Y Charlie, Charlie sí. Ah. También Charlie. Josué. También Josué. Ajá, sí. Josué, ¿verdad? Pero sí. Josué, ¿sabes qué le pasó? Yo no continúo. Ah, de veras, ¿no? No me ha contestado Josué para hacer la tarea. Así que no sí. tengo pareja. ¿Quién no tiene? Sí, yo no tengo, tengo pareja. Yo no tengo, bueno. no me, acord, no me acordaba ah, pues, de la tarea. Si quiere la hacemos, Beatriz. Vaya. No tengo tampoco pareja. Yeah, I don't know what happened, to, what happened to Josué, but he's not connecting anymore. No. It's like three days that he has ah. to connect to class. So for attendance, he already failed. Okay. Yeah. I don't know what Qué lástima, qué lástima. Teenagers, teenagers. Mm. Así nos pasa cuando estamos jóvenes, creemos que tenemos toda la vida por delante. Yes. Llegamos, a los llegamos a los 40 y pa. Pregúnteme a mí, llegué ah, a los 69 y mírame. Y mira, pa. ¿y por qué, verdad? ¿Y por qué? ¿Por qué? Sí. But it's never too late, Beatriz. It's never too late. Provechito, Zaira. All right, guys. Remember, we have our final written test today. And on Monday, you have the final speaking evaluation. We finished the level on Monday. And as for right now, the, uh, mm, <laughs> no se los he podido mandar, but the results are pretty, pretty good, pretty good. No, no tienen mayor uh, necesidad de preocupación por las notas. You are doing a great job. Okay. It's uh, good news. Mm -hmm. I hope that you continue the same for the next and the next and the next and the next and the next. Finality. Uh, uh -huh, till the end. Till the end. <laughs> and remember, guys, um, try to to always be uh what's the word? No me despertado el cerebro todavía. Consistent. Consistent. Coffee teacher. I know. <laughs> Try to always be consistent and, and continue. Because if not, you will have to wait a long time to start again. Traten de mantener siempre la, de ser consistente, siempre conectarse, enviar toda la documentación rápido para que no vayan a esperar demasiado tiempo a iniciar el otro. Y que no les vayan a, a cerrar el grupo también. I see. Mm -hmm. Así Cuando hacen más personas también, ahí recomienden, recomienden. Teacher, yo recomendé, pero a mi mejor amigo le rechazaron la solicitud. Why? 
cuando mandaron el como una imagen, él la mandó y le dijeron que era porque él estaba eh, buscando trabajo y que así no podía. Y yeah, es que es it's very complicated porque eso es lo que pasa, que se quedan a la mitad y luego ya no pueden continuar y el grupo se queda pausado. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Por eso. Pero se puede como adecuar los horarios. Por ejemplo, si ya no se puede en la mañana, puede ser en la tarde. ¿En el trabajo o acá? No, acá. Hay ¿Eh? horarios de seis y media, ¿verdad? Ajá, pero, pero esa es la cosa de que Por los, o sea, los cambios son, son bien complicados. Oh, okay. Porque si se van de acá... Para tratar de llenar allá, dejan aquí cuto el grupo y ya no puede continuar este grupo. Porque esa por requiere un mínimo de 25 o 28 personas. Algo así. Okay. Ajá. Entonces ahí es donde ellos se ponen un poquito más estrictos con la cuestión de la... Que se está buscando trabajo, no porque no va a dejar a media. ¿no? Ok. Por eso. But... Y lástima que no hay de fin de semana también. Porque sería otra opción. La verdad sería muy buena. Aunque yeah. fueran más horas. Eh, estuvo publicándose en Facebook uno de fin de semana. De los sábados y el otro el domingo. Pero no de del, speak. ¿Cómo no? Ah, no, de, no sé si fue de speak. No, pero sí no. era de Insafo. Es que como son varias academias las que trabajan con el programa. Ah, bueno. Ah, y un día de estos conocidos es que queda la oficina de Speak. Ah, por el escalón. Sí, 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 lo conocí allá por las Margot. Ajá, ajá. Por los típicos, por los típicos. Bueno. Sí. Yes, parece. Pero hasta en el presencial necesitan un número de personas porque si no lo cierran. Sí, sí, es que con, la, con eso sí. EPN Strict in Safor. Recuerden que están haciendo una inversión, o sea. Y es más pérdida si las personas se van que la ganancia que puede obtener la empresa. Por eso es sí. que Insafor es bastante estricto con la parte de la asistencia. Incluso si no se llega al 80% de la asistencia hay un problemón con la cuestión del, del money, 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 money. Así que quédense, no se vayan y continúen y traigan más gente. Díganle que no trabajen todavía hasta que hablen inglés. <risa> Hasta más trabajo le va a salir. All right. Uh, yes, Monica. The picture. Oh, yeah. I'm still waiting for some of you to come in because bien poquitos han entrado. Sí. Pero 19 están. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to wait a couple of minutes more before I take it. In the meantime, just, uh, oops, no change. They haven't changed the date here. Today is the 25th, five more days and we finish August, three more oh. months and we finish the year. Christmas is coming, people. Christmas is coming. Como la canción de Santa Claus is coming to town. Coming to town, Coming to town. Good morning, Erika. Yeah, no gift, no gift, no gift for Christmas. <laughs> All right, people. Let's start. Tell me, what do you remember about yesterday? What did we study yesterday? We study uh, if, cause, and effect. Uh -huh, we were talking about cause if, and cause effect. And effect. Using if, if, if right? Yeah. Goes. If goes <clears throat> in the cause or in the effect. Cause. Uh -huh. If something happened, we have a result, right? Yeah. Can you give me an example? Like you have an exam today. What examples can you give me with the exam context? And he uh, when it rain, I if 
use the umbrella? If it rains, I use an umbrella. Okay, if it rains, I use an umbrella. Rains with the letter S because it's third person singular, right? Yeah. Can you give me another example? If she happy, if if she is happy, uh -huh. he, he always smile. All right. She always smile. Nice. If she's happy, she always smile. Or she always smile if she's happy. All right. Very good. Another one? If, if, if you say in this. Repeat, Irma. If it use and dish. Mm, what are you trying to say? Is if it, uh -huh. it, it use, 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 use and dish. A dish. Uh -huh. How do you say plato? A dish. A dish. A dish. Yeah. A dish. A dish. A dish. A dish. Uh -huh. A dish. A dish. <laughs> what dish. Hmm. So this is the cause. Now the effect and the result. What are you trying uh, to say? Remember that uh, it, it is two ideas together, right? Two ideas together. One is a cause, una causa, and then we have an effect, un effect que proviene de esta causa. Ah, uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. For example, si me pegan, lloro. Right? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. So, uh, uh, if, if it, uh, I eat more, uh, uh, sucio, dirty, 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 como se dice, what to say, dirty, 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 dirty uh, yeah. which I have, uh, Lavar, wash. 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 Let's organize the idea. It could be something like, okay, you come at my house and you eat, and I tell you, sí. if, if you if you use the plate, you have to wash it. Uh -huh. If you use the plate, you have to wash it, right? If you use it, wash it. Exactly. Mm -hmm. exactly. All right. One more. I'm hungry. If if he is sick, he takes medicine. If he is sick, uh huh, he takes medicine. Yes, good, 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 good. good. So this is what we studied yesterday: the if for a cause and then an effect. I forgot to tell you the name of the structure. Just just so you know. We are working with the zero conditional. There are four conditionals in English, and this is the zero one. We're going to study all of them in the future. Now, remember the structure, right? First, if, and then the, uh, the present simple for the first part. And the second part, only the present simple. Here I have these images. So can you come up or invent examples about the pictures? Like the first one here, what can you tell me about this picture using the conditional? Um, he, mm -hmm. he is cool to school. But remember, a conditional, a conditional. If blah, 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 blah. Uh, blah. If, if he frozen. <laughs> but that would be the effect, Erika. Uh, if, uh, if, if it's cold. If it's cold. If, if it is cold. He use. She or he? He. He, he is cold. He? Waiting. Wears, remember, wears. He uh -huh. wears. He wears a coat. Oh. If it's cold, he wears a coat. Uh -huh. 
How would you say si no usa un abrigo se congela? Uh, it's, it's not used. Use. Who? Who? He, subject, subject. he, 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 he. If he? He, if he, well, use not. Don't. He, he. Auxiliary for negative? Don't, don't. Uh, doesn't. Third person, third person. <clears throat> doesn't. Doesn't. If he doesn't. Where? Where? A coat. You freeze. He's free. He. He free. Freezes. Freezes. He freezes. All right. Second picture. We have a boy with an exam in the letter F. Is the letter F a good or bad grade? Mm. Bad. F is bad. So. What situation can you invent? What condition? If, if he if is studying, study, uh, get, 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 it's like, uh, get, get, if, if he if don't he, study, don't, no, third person, no third person. Study. Does, 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 Remember does, the auxiliary is for the simple present. Don't is for I, you, we, they. If he, she he is, doesn't, 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 he doesn't, doesn't, he he get bad, he get, he get or he gets, 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 gets bad. Huh? A bad grade. Oh, grade. A bad grade. <clears throat> if he doesn't study, he gets a bad grade. Uh huh. Now here we have a person with the ice bag on his on his head because he has a headache. So what can you tell about him? Mm -hmm. Or oh, what would you recommend? He's sick. What would you mm -hmm. recommend? If he, if he sick, if if burp, burp, burp. if he does have a headache, if he have a headache, uh, third person, third person, third person has has, 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 has a headache. Eso me cuesta la tercera persona. Me too. If he has a headache, he he puts. The ice bath in the hand, on the head, <laughs> ice bath in the hand on his, on his uh, head, on his head. He put an ice bag on his head. Now, this is a house for sale. What situation can you come up with about this situation? If it if it remember that it, it doesn't, say, it doesn't have to, to say uh-huh what to say, say arreglar fix what fix 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 if it uh oh if it don't have house it no if it no it Remember the houses don't make actions. No, la acción es arreglar. Y si no uh -huh. la arregla, no la vende. Yeah, but who fixes the house? The selling. The seller. The seller. So if, if he if the seller or if he, the seller if the seller sell the house <laughs> what happened yeah it's if the seller sells the house, the house. fix first algo así <laughs> mm -hmm. no mm -hmm. make a fix what's the what's the what's the cost and what's the effect selling Cause or effect? 
effect. So, what's the cost? Six. Uh -huh. So, the cost is what if, remember. Uh -huh. So, what needs to be done first? This, uh, sell the, the house. house. Mm. No, 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 no. If, if the seller make a fee, make fix, a make a fix. Fixes. 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 Sure. Fixes. Uh -huh. Before sell the house. No, no, ya me perdí. If the seller fixes the house, what happened? The seller sells the house. He sells it. So, he oh. sells it. If the seller fixes the house, he sells it. Mm -hmm. Okay. You can also say, if you don't have a house, you can buy this one. If you don't have a house, you can buy this one. Mm -hmm. Now, we have two people here that they are very happy because they are drinking alcohol. <laughs> they are drunk, drunk. So what can you say about them? Uh-huh. We have two drunk people. If they if they drink, drink the beer, I... <laughs> if they drink, they are happy. <laughs> <laughs> All right, they are happy. They are happy. They are happy. <laughs> Another one. If you run, if it's run fast. No, 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 still with the drunk people. Oh. Uh -huh. We're going to get this, to this one in a moment. Keep the idea. But here. If they are bored, they are sing. They? They are drink. They sing. They sick or drink? Sing. 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 They drink. Sing. 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 Uh -huh. If they are bored, they drink. Okay, yeah, that's a good one. Dijo cantar. Sing. Uh -huh. Ah, sing. Yeah. Oh, okay, I'm sorry, Charlie. They sing, okay. <laughs> they sing. Thank you. <clears throat> now we go with the athlete here. What can you say about the athlete? If he, if he, he runs fast. Okay. If it runs fast, he's tired. He's he tired. Gets tired. He gets tired. He gets tired. What else can you tell? Think of think out of the box. Think out of the box. The situation is an athlete running. <laughs> don't don't focus only on what you see on the picture, but come up with different contexts. Like we have an athlete tired because he's training. And he has a competition, you can say something like if he trains a lot, he trains a lot, he wins the competition. Uh -huh. So tell me one more. If he got the gym or get the if gym, he goes, goes to the gym. If he, if he goes to the gym. Uh -huh. He drinks water. All right. He is exhausted. He, all right. He has to drink water and he feels exhausted, as Gabby said. If he goes to the gym, he has to drink water. We're going to change the animal okay, because he feels exhaust, exhausted. Right, and the last one, 
we have a good student like you. So tell me, what happens if you are good students? Mm -hmm. If she. If she. Has. Studies. What happens? So much. A lot. Because too much will be negative. I'm sorry, Catherine. We will have good grades. She has good grades. Very good. <coughs> another one. <coughs> Can you give me another one? Uh huh. Come on, come on. If she has good grade, is she happy? She is happy. Mm -hmm. Or she feels happy. She'll feel happy. If she has good grade, she feels happy. Good. Can you give me another one? The last one? Uh-huh, 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 uh-huh. Uh, que están pensando. If if that homework, if she does homework, uh huh. Wait. She have a free time. She has, huh? Free time. No, oh, she has free time. If she does her homework early, let's say, early, she has free time or more free time. Okay, Charlie, good, good, thank you. Those are very good examples. Just give me one second, I'm gonna take the picture. No, let's save it, save it, save it, save it, save it, save it. Save it, save it. It, it is, it, it is. All right, got the first one. All right, people, get pen and paper ready because you are going to have your exam right now. So please, if you are here, Jaime, Katie, Consuelo, Jessica, open your cameras because you're going to have the, the evaluation. And what are you going to do? This is what you are going to do here. That's your exam. Number one, you are going to write 10 sentences describing what you and your family are doing. Number two, you are going to write five abilities that you have. Number three, you are going to write five abilities you don't have. And then you are going to answer the questions and please give complete answers. So in this case, what is your favorite sport? Don't say only soccer. No, complete answer. My favorite sport is soccer, okay? How often do you practice that sport? Where do you practice the sport? Who do you practice the sport with? And why do you like that sport? Number five, imagine you are a doctor and you are giving advice to one of your patients. Write five instructions he or she has to follow. Use imperatives. Remember what we studied a couple of days ago. Then read the following situations and write a request for each of them. I am called. Write a request. What would you say? I am called. Uh, can you please prepare me a coffee? Can you please lend me your sweater? Whatever. I need to go to the airport. I don't know how to use my cell phone. I need some groceries, but I don't have time to go to the supermarket. 
and I need to pay my university, but I don't have the money. And finally, answer the following questions. And once again, give complete answers. What happens if you don't study for an exam? So complete answer, if I don't study for an exam, blah, 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 blah. Yeah. What happens if you don't pay your water bill? What happens if you don't eat for more than 10 days? What happens if you don't stop uh, in a red light? And what happens if you don't practice your English? So write it down, the answers on a piece of paper. Later, take a picture and send it to my WhatsApp. Okay. 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 <laughs> All right, guys, start. That's okay. your evaluation. Teacher, le vamos a tomar captura y le vamos a mandar solo las respuestas al WhatsApp o lo vamos a transcribir? No, just the answers. Only the answers. Yes. But stay here. No se vayan a ir a hacerlo. Stay here with the cameras on. Y no le van a copiar a que está a la par, please. Mm -hmm. Ahí solo, teacher, solo la respuesta, ¿va? no la pregunta. ¿va? Solo la respuesta. Only la the answer, ah. yes. Okay. Number one, answers. Number two, answers. Okay. And don't forget to write your names. Just in case. Teacher, uh, hand, handwriting. Handwriting, yes, handwriting, yeah. Okay. Que le duela. <laughs> yeah. No, si ahorita no va a asesinar usted con esto. <laughs> yeah, it's very easy. Too easy. I always try to make it difficult, but it's too easy all the time. Hi, Heaven. Welcome. Thank you, teacher. Al WhatsApp o acá el chat este de, de, del grupo, teacher. WhatsApp. Oh. To my WhatsApp.
Don Pocho. <risa>
Ah, Mónica. Que mande. <risa> es que estoy pensando. También concentrados. <risa> Brushing se utiliza también para cepillarse los dientes. Yes. Para decir que... Remember, you, you will write only the answers, right? Solo las respuestas. Número uno, la respuesta. Número dos. Uh, teacher, me da unos minutos. ¿Qué están buscando? Sí, ¿Eh? Teacher. Yes, Gabby. In the number five, only instruction. Yes. Why only instruction? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Thank you. Yes, that teacher. 
Solo me tomé unos minutos porque tenía que atender. Pero aquí sí. Okay. <ríe> Gracias. You're welcome.
I have a question. Yes, Erika. En la número cinco, number five. Um, o sea, solo, ay, solo podemos, tenemos que decir la recomendación solamente de lo que, de lo, o sea, el doctor al paciente. Yes, remember when we talked about imperatives. Right? Okay. Mm -hmm. Only the instruction. Thank you. Uh, thank you. La número seis, teacher, es este, es, eh, el, ¿cómo se llama? La causa y el efecto, ¿va? ¿Qué tengo que hacer, va? Yes. Okay. Oh, no, 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 no. Ah, oh, Jaime, I'm sorry. Cause and effect is number seven. Number six is request. Remember, I need a framework, so you make the request. Those are the situations. Ah, okay. You make the request. Okay. Thank you.
question teacher yes I am Vaya, este, en, en esa que le preguntaba, eh, ¿es necesario volver a repetir la situación o solo la, la solicitud? Only the request. Only the request, ya. Yeah. Ok, ok.
teacher. Yes, Bea. Uh, the, the answer number seven, the letter, letter D. Mm -hmm. No, I don't. Pay money, take, money, the take, water bill. No, 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 tome, no, no me salió aquí. Ah, oh. quiero ver. No, ya, ya estuvo, ya estuvo. Es que le tomé foto. Oh, ok. Para no estar así. <laughs> <coughs> you... Almost time, people, almost time. Teacher. Yes, Erika. En la parte, en la parte seis, eso era, o sea, esas oraciones también llevan ir. Mm -mm, no. No, eso era como lo que estuvimos haciendo eh, de que poníamos la, como la. Ay, ay no sé. <laughs> Remember imperatives like when we gave rules and instructions cuando estamos que en el hospital, en el banco, manejando. Pero ahí era que le teníamos que hacer la pregunta. Mm -mm. No, no sé, no sé qué, no sé, no. Remember, remember, remember. Okay, thank you. Mm -hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Hey people, whatever you have, send it through. Lo que sea que tengan hasta el momento, send it over. Time up. Solo me falta una, teacher. Los, la número siete. Ok, ok. More time, please. Ok. Ay, me acaban de dar una mala noticia. Wow. 
mi nieta y mi y mi y la esposa de mi hijo acaban de salir positivos también. Sorry. Ay, señor. Yeah. Be positive. Uh, that will take care of everything. Está muy bien también mi sobrina también. Más uh -huh. que está bien. Sí, sí, la niña tiene dos años. Ah, y la niña tiene un año. Está ahorita ahí en el hospital. Ah. Solo el papá está en el hospital en El Salvador. Hoy la llevé en la mañana que le hicieran la prueba y salieron positivos. Primero Dios, todo esté bien. Todo bueno. Ah, primero Dios. Primero, primero Dios, Dios, todo va a salir bien. Va, primero Dios. Ah, mi nombre. Beatriz, aíslenlos y este, les dan de alta en el sistema. Ya eh, les entregaron la prueba. Sí, ahorita le acaban de dar la respuesta. Okay, tienen que darle de alta, le van a mandar su kit, este, sigan las indicaciones, contesten las llamadas que les hace el mensal para que eh, puedan darles la asistencia telefónica y eh, aíslenlos a, a, los, a las dos. Eh, suficiente agua, eh, medicamentos, solo lo que el médico le deje, ¿verdad? Y sí. eh, los cuidados en casa, no salir, usar mascarilla. Sí. Sí, sí, sí. Gracias, Hebel. Ellos viven solitos enfrente de mi casa, está su casa. Ahorita las dos ellas están solas porque su papá, el, el esposo de ella está hospitalizado. En su caso, usted es una persona de alto riesgo, por lo tanto, eh, sí. la sugerencia es que no sea usted quien los atienda, que sea otra persona, utilice mascarilla, el, 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 los guantes y, y ropa que utilice, eh, descargarlas a la hora de entrar, embolsarlas por dos días y hasta el tercer día lavarlas. Perfecto. Okay. Gracias, gracias, Hebel. personal, ¿verdad, teacher? Yes, Beatriz. Ahí me la invitación al cafecito, también al cine. <risa> Aquí lo esperamos, con chocobananos, con paletas de, <coughs> de mango verde. Oh. Teacher. Yes, Carla. Uh, en la pregunta 6, uh, donde dice, I, I, no comprendo. I could. I, see, I could. I'm sorry, Carla, but I can't tell you. It's an exam. Okay. Yeah, sorry. Ya se lo mandamos, ya no hay más tiempo. Almost time, it's almost time. Okay. okay. In the meantime, guys, and remember Monday, you have the final speaking evaluation. So please study, study, study the uh, what we have started estos últimos días porque va a ser improvisado. Lo único que pueden hacer ahorita es buscar con quién va a ser en pareja. Y ahí solo les voy a poner ahí un tema. Y van a tener que inventar un diálogo en el momento. Ok. Por ejemplo, les pongo el tema. Háblenos de sus planes para el fin de semana, por ejemplo. Y comienzan ahí. Ok. Hola, ¿cómo estás? Muy bien. ¿Y tú? Mira, ¿qué vas a hacer el sábado? Ah, voy a hacer esto, 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 esto. esto. Uh -huh. O hágame un diálogo ahorita utilizando, haciendo solicitudes, making requests. Y así van a tener que improvisar la conversación. ¿Ok? 
Así que estudien. No todos. Quizás vaya, lo, con la misma estructura que están aquí en el examen. Que está el presente progresivo, habilidades, request y, los, y el condicional. Thank you, Hilma. Thank you, Bea. Thank you, Charlie. Thank you, Gaby. Hey, guys. Something else. Whatever you have, send it over. Send it over. Was it difficult? Not right. Thank you, Monica. Thank you, Alison. Monica, Allison, Hilma, Beatriz, Jaime, thank you. Uh, teacher. Yes, Charlie. Uh, for Monday, we have to finish the platform, right? Oh, yes. También. Don't, 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 don't forget about it. Complete the platform. Porque ese también tiene como un 10% de la nota. No. The speak platform, yeah. Ahí le sí. mandé este, dos fotos eh, porque no me caían en una sola página, teacher. Yeah, 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 yeah. that's fine. Me cayó no la primera y la segunda, sí va, está bien. No problem, yeah. Yes, okay. I have okay. the two one. One, six, seven, yes. I have it all. Teacher, revise si se ve bien porque lo hice con lápiz y casi no, creo que no se nota. Ya, yeah, ya me veo bien, sí. <laughs> Yes, yes, Monica. Okay. Right. Time's up. I got Beatriz, Carlos, Allison, Gaby. Um, Ilma, Monica, Jaime, Table. La foto, la foto.
Y esta es la foto. Right. Time. Hola, Jessica. Tiene mala Lo siento, teacher. No me di cuenta que tenía el micrófono encendido. Ah, ok. <ríe> no problem, no problem. Okay, people, time's up. Time to finish the class. So please study hard for Monday. That's going to be your final evaluation, right? 20% more. But I guess examen va a valer 20%. And it will be improvised because mm -hmm. you have to demonstrate the knowledge you have acquired. So I recommend you to study. Uh, present continuous can for possibilities and requests imperatives as well and conditional and if if okay teacher and also remember how to make greetings how to and how to say farewells como saludar y cómo despedirse, para que no se vaya directo a la pregunta, ¿verdad? Sino que con un uh, saludo, luego la conversación y la despedida. ¿Ok? Ok, teacher. Right. Well, thank you for everything, people. I see you on Monday. Have a wonderful, wonderful, wonderful weekend. And okay. enjoy your weekend. Bye. Happy weekend. Bye, bye. Me van para la playa y me avisan. Teacher, teacher, teacher. Yes, Erika. Mire, ahorita yo estoy conectada de otro teléfono, entonces solo le tomo la foto, eh, lo mando, porque no, no tengo el, el número del chat ahorita, pero se lo voy a mandar a, a alguien para que lo mande el número ese. Ok. Del chat. No ¿Sí? problem. Yes, sí, Erika, si no terminamos. O sea, lo que tengan ahorita, mande. Que ahorita se lo mando, teacher. Vaya, 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 vaya. Gracias. Bye, bye. Bye, bye. Bye. Bye, teacher. Goodbye, goodbye.